back to freedom with freedom case you're new here hi my name is Frida Guku and this is the best place for you today I am taking you through installation of this wall that you're seeing here um, so it's a bed sitter and we just want to change one wall the clients want to just have a spice up uh, of the wall so the house doesn't look so just dull just to brighten the house and we are doing uh, a white a red let me show you guys this is the so i want to take you guys through the process there are just two rolls so uh, if the camera can pick the wall it's going to take around one and a half rolls from here all the way to that other side so it's not like a big row it's not like a big wall. mostly most of the walls take two to three rolls no more walls, two rolls. And a roll is 1500, but right now I have an offer going on for 1050. So these ones are going for 1050, just in case you want to spice up your place and you want to be able to take the ones on offer. Again, it's just 1050 uh, per roll and a roll is 10 meters by 0 0.5 meters. So it's 10 meters long. If I open it straight up, it's 10 meters. And then this is 0 0.5 meters. Then this is the glue that we use. I'll show you guys how I mix it because most of you asked that question. So that is going to come in a few minutes. Again, um, most of you ask, is does it destroy the wall? It doesn't. I have answered that like a few times. So it doesn't destroy the wall. But you cannot move with the wallpaper and go install somewhere else. That one you can do. Again, you can put on a wall. You can put on a wooden. You can put on a plywood. There's, there's a lot you can do with... Uh, wallpaper so come with me and let's beautify this space right here so let's get ready so um if you want to install wallpaper for yourself ensure that you have an apron or something that will cover up because the glue that you're using in a destroying guasana leaves some whitey stuff on outfit so if you check my apron has some white stuff so you can protect your outfits with this apron and also you look professional then we have uh, tools of work, uh, which is this. This is a cutter. You've seen this again on the video before. I'm going to leave it in the description box in, it, in case you need to see more. This is a cutter. You use it to cut the wallpaper. This is a scrapper. It's what you use to scrap the wall, um, the wallpaper so that um, the glue doesn't leave the bubbles on the wallpaper. Then you can use a roller for your glue or you use um, a brush whichever works for you right uh, so i want to show you guys just how the wallpaper looks just keep over two of how this wallpaper looks uh, again this is client's choice so this is how it looks it's a beautiful part of black black bit of red so You'll see the final. So this is the length. So Kifungwa Kabisa is going to be 10 meters. Then this is 0 0.5 meters. So if you put it in a square, it will be like 5 square meters. Am I making sense? Yes. So yeah, let's get moving. So this glue installs 4 to 5 rolls. A lot of people ask me what's the name of the glue. I also don't know the name of the glue. It's just a wallpaper glue. When you import the wallpapers, it comes with this. So um, this one can install four to five um, wallpapers depending on how heavy the wallpaper is. So if the wallpaper is too heavy, it means it, it's going to take more glue, right? So I've put some water here. Again, I can't tell you exactly how much the quantity of water, but I'll tell you how runny it's supposed to be. Oh, sorry. So you just tear a little bit, then mix as you pour and keep mixing. So you're just going to estimate that if this one installs four, there's a point you make a more installs four, then half of it is enough for two. Keep mixing. Then give it time, a few seconds, because as it cools down, it becomes thicker. Don't put it all, otherwise you're going to have a lot of waste. So let's give it time, see how it's going to turn. I will run, I will climb, I will soar. I'm undefeated. Oh, 
jumping out of my skin for the cold. Yeah, I'll be a step. Measure the length of the the piece that you want to install first. So sometimes wallpaper we'll look um the opposite side, as you can see, easy meat is me and So that means you have to turn the wallpaper. Otherwise, so I can't clients akumeze. So you take um, the measurements up to down and cut it. Give yourself some allowance because anything can happen. So you don't have to fix down there. So this is our first piece. Um, so glue is ready. I won't show you how runny it is. So this is how it runs. It's not so runny. It's not so runny. It's like as thick as some good polish. I will reach, I will fly Until I'm breaking, until I'm breaking Out my cage like a bird in the night I know I'm changing, I know I'm Apply glue on the piece Ensure that it's touching the edges Hey, it is Evenly spread Again, fly on this other side. And then we spread. And apply glue to the wall. This is something that people forget. If you want to have some easy installation, apply glue to the wall too. Remember guys, you don't have to apply paint if you're doing one paper. It's still going to hold, even without paint. As long as the wall is smooth, it's going to hold perfectly. And the glue is not harmful, so don't fear. So now I'm turning the wallpaper because I need the, the pattern of these trees the apples you see now the trees are looking upwards when I was cutting it was down looking come it is in the lala size is the mama This will help you to straighten the wallpaper so you don't have bubbles. Some of you are going out there and installing wallpapers with your own plain hands. Remember wallpaper can tear, don't forget that that is a possibility by the way, but uh, you can always fix it with the glue and it will be back to normal. So guys, remember this wallpaper has a pattern. So when you're cutting your second piece, ensure that the pattern match before you even cut it. Now, this example is this is a pattern that is supposed to join with this piece of white here so that it completes that um, what, what shape is this? It completes this square so make sure that you take that note before you cut. That's where the problem comes in with most of you. Take note of the pattern before you cut the wallpaper otherwise it's gonna mess you up.
done. This, this, this is a transformation. So we used two rolls from this end to this end. Perfectly fit and that is the look. I hope you guys will like it. I'm sure you can look looking at it you can't even see where the connections is you can't see a line the flowers are matching the trees are standing <laughs> the, everything is just working perfectly anyway guys follow my page on instagram and facebook i join my call papers and deco the person behind the camera is just laughing uh, I join my call um, wallpapers and decor. I'm gonna leave on the description box so you can follow me for more of these images, for more more transformation. And again, if you just need to get samples of what we have, we have over a thousand samples. You can call me on zero seven eight six nine two three four five two. The number is here or somewhere here, whatever. But follow me. Thank you for staying tuned up to this and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Give this video a thumbs up and see you on my next video. Stay positive. Stay focused. Bye!